Hey everyone, got another video for you today and it's on Ripple. So actually some great news for Ripple. So Bankera, which is a digital bank, their goal is to be the, 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 the banking for the blockchain era. That's their slogan they have on their website here. Um, so essentially they are a digital bank. Um, they have officially uh, acquired the Pacific Private Bank. Now, this was announced early in February where there was talks about them acquiring this company. Well, they released a uh, press release saying they have officially the, finished the acquisition. So uh, Pacific Private Bank is now owned by Bankera. Now, how does this involve Ripple? Well, their plan is to connect Pacific Private Bank uh, to the Ripple network. So let's go into the details. So just to give you some background into who or what Pacific Private Bank is, is about they were founded in 1997 and they have over 21 years of experience specializing in asset and wealth management services for private clients so bank here's a quote from the uh press release bankera's team will empower the pacific private bank with bank level blockchain technology in order to do so one of the first steps to be done is to connect the pacific private bank to the ripple network so this is awesome. Ripple is getting more banks on board. As they've stated, they are working with over 100 financial institutions. Um, that includes banks, money transfer companies, and so forth. Uh, Bankera, just to give you some more details, is dedicated to building a fully, fully digital bank, as mentioned, without the costly limitations of physical branches that will one day represent a single destination for a complete range of financial services. It operates as a fork of SpectroCoin, which was a bank-like infrastructure with more than 700,000 clients and five years of maturity in the cryptocurrency market. With this technological strength, Bankera will augment Pacific Private Bank with bank-level blockchain tech, beginning with a first step, as mentioned, connecting with the Ripple network, simultaneously facilitating cross-border, low-cost, and ultra-trick ultra quick transactions together with sophisticated blockchain based identity management so ripple this is great for ripple they're beginning their technology is now being noticed by uh, other companies and other startups and things like that who are now bringing them on board bringing their acquisitions their clients to work on the ripple network so this is a great news for ripple as i've been uh mentioning in my videos the more clients and more companies, banks, money transfer companies that Ripple has working with it, um, some of those folks are going to directly work on XRapid, such as MoneyGram and Western Union um, and SBI Holdings. Um, and some of the other banks and financial institutions are going to work with XCurrent. However, the folks at Ripple, their CEO, many of their team members have clearly stated the goal is to get those folks to use XRapid which is powered, um, which has XRP running on it. So uh, this is great news. This is any partnership, any type of acquisitions, any type of relationship being built by Ripple will help it in the long run with its growth, its adoption, and more folks getting on X Rapid. So very exciting. I also wanted to share something. David Schwartz, who I've mentioned in videos before, he is the chief cryptographer at Ripple, and he generally replies to questions on Twitter, does a really great job. Um, someone asked him a question, and he gave a, uh, a nice quick summary that, about XRP and, and XCurrent, so XRapid and XCurrent. So he says, XCurrent is a product used primarily by banks to provide a payment endpoint. It doesn't compel any particular means of settlement. Ripple is positioning XRP as a settlement asset for payments. So that's why I've been telling you guys, even if these banks come on board and they are not leveraging XRapid, which um, is powered by XRP, and they're just using XCurrent, it doesn't matter. Ripple's goal is to then pitch them and upsell them and incentivize them to use the XRapid protocol um, to settle payments because they reckon... They recognize the real world problem of what's happening with money being uh, for cross border payments and all that stuff um, and settlements and so forth. So they're providing a solution. And this is why I see potential in, in Ripple and XRP and why I'm invested in it. So all around good news, guys. 
Um, another day, another positive news for Ripple. Uh, but I think this is this is very nice that Bankera, uh, another company in itself, is working and getting you know these the, this bank on board with the Ripple network. So, what do you guys think about this news? Leave your comments in the comment section. Thumbs up if you like this video, and please subscribe for more videos on Ripple and other cryptocurrencies. I'll talk to you guys later.